Hello and welcome to our VFX channel tutorial and today we are going to finish off our mental ray tutorials and we're going to cover clay rendering. So I'm just going to make a new scene and it's going to be simple. I'm just going to put a plane. Teapot. And I'm going to use a knot to Okay, uh, I'm going to add some light into the scene. I'm just going to go to the lights, standard, and skylight. I'm going to place it right about here. I want it facing the ground and them. Okay, right. We're just going to go to render setup. We're going to go to common, assign renderer, production, and then change it to mental ray. But I've already changed it, so it's fine. We're going to go to renderer, and we're going to change the sample per pixel. I'm going to change the minimum to 4 and the maximum to 64. And then we're going to indirect illumination. And we're going to change this one to 30 and the raise per FG point to 250. This one to 27. Uh, the diffuse bounds to 1 and weight to 0.4. Now, the, when we were changing the sample per pixel, you know, that basically makes everything smooth out, so it, it looks better. Right, I think we're ready to render. I'm going to render the perspective. Actually, I'm going to change the colour of like the plane, change that to white. change this to like a light grey we'll just keep that like that ok now we're ready to render let's click render now this may take a while so I'm just going to pause the video and then start the game when I'm finished uh, so I'm finished my rendering uh, I rendered this earlier I just thought this was a wee bit better uh, it's the same settings and all that, it's just a different camera angle. Uh, the shadows are a wee bit greeny, but you can sort that out. I'm sure I covered that in a different tutorial. Uh, so, thanks for watching and visit VFX channel for more 3D Max tutorials and Photoshop tutorials.